What's up you guys, it's Jason here and welcome back to my channel for another Clash Royale video and in today's video um, I'm going to show you guys the best Royal Giant deck for Legendary Arena players So this deck here got me up to, I don't have like really high level cards, I just have the Royal G up to level 11 And all the cards are tournament standards except um, the minions and the zap here so I will let you guys see my personal bass here we're still on our personal bass here currently so I'm gonna show you guys some replays and let's get into one of them and yeah let's get into these chances quickly so I'll show you guys this replay here that I'm against some guy from I don't know so we'll see we'll see Okay, so in this deck you don't want, if you have the Royal G, I recommend you just put the Royal G down without thinking. But if you're on low elixir and you know the enemy has like elite barbs, I would not recommend you to do it. Yeah. So actually the tombstone is for defense like, I mean like tombstone and... Uh, elite barbarians. The ice golem is to kite them. Uh, I mean, like mm, the ice golem is gonna kite them to the left or the right lane, depends what you do. So he has a good counter on using the barbarians to defend here. By the way, guys, if you don't, if you guys don't have the executioner, you can always use the ice wizard. It will be a good, a, a good combo. So. The tree musket here, uh, I don't usually use the tree musket here at the battle. I will always use it after I one crown a, the dude or the guy. So I can place the tree musket at the center so he can damage the, so they can damage the tower quickly. So I don't have to think like mm, getting more damage. Tombstone to defense right here. Sorry guys, I'm being a little bit sick. Okay, so far we're not defending that Drake. But we are against a level 10. Wow. So guys, if you guys want me to do like um, a, la a Bass Lava Hound deck, so cause my friend Justin, he is a level 9 guy, but he's a, la he's a level 9 guy, but He's at 4,000 trophies because he's using a lava hound deck. So if you guys are interested for, uh, you guys are looking for a lava hound deck, or you guys are using the lava hound deck, make sure to comment down. I want a lava hound deck because I'll make that really soon enough. But I, I don't think I can make it now because I'm having exams now. Because yeah, if I don't get good grades, yeah, I'll end up, you know, not making videos because my mom would not like me to do that. He's like one of them, like um, a really protective, yeah, a really protective parent. So yeah, I'll post more videos after my exam. But here, in the meanwhile, we're gonna use the tombstone here for defense for the royal giant. And here, I think we got the minions. Nope, we didn't. The execution got to swing off. So here, his tower has like uh, 216 damage, and I, I think yeah, we can. Yeah, we can fireball it down, and that is good game. So now, guys, let's get into another attack, life attack, and let's see what we can get here. Okay. So if you guys want to see, I mean, like um, legendary glitches or random moments, I'm doing a random moment video currently, and I'll post them after the uh after my exam and yeah so if you guys want to see massive chest opening like super magical chest opening or legendary chest opening make sure to comment down below so let's just get into a live attack here and let's see if we can win so here we're against a from t nation so we're gonna give him a good luck <coughs> sorry guys i'm a bit of, a bit of sick here so now we have a decent starting hand we got the royal giant the minions and he's gonna let go with the love hound here. Wow. Round's gonna crush my ball so hard here. No counter right there though. But we're gonna go with a tombstone here. One more shot. Nice. Okay. 
And I'm guessing he's gonna go with the uh, the default. No. Uh oh, that's not looking good, mate. I told him to defend. Wow, you guys saw that? Wow. The executioner racked all the level pops in a swing. I mean, like, wow, you don't see that every day. Okay, you gotta be ready for the balloon here. Okay, executioner, some swings, please. Okay, not bad here. He's gonna go with the fireball here. So we're gonna go with the Royal Gen. Hopefully he doesn't use his Scout Tsunami here. If he does use his Scout Tsunami, we'll figure out what that means. Wow, okay. The Royal Gen is gonna take out the tower here, I guess. It's not gonna do anything cause... Yeah, Royal Gen is the best, but... Royal Gen is God. I'm just gonna... Minions here to take out. Yep, minions here to take out. Uh, what do you call it? Yeah. Oh, the balloon? He's gonna go the other side, so I'm gonna use my execution here to take it out. Yes, level pops are gonna behave like usual. And here's the magic, guys. Watch. We're gonna zap the electro. Oh, we miss it. Again. We miss again. Wow. What luck do we have around here? Gonna go with the minions here to take out the sky tsunami. And here you guys, here's the magic. We're gonna go with the three musketeer the center here. He just uses crowd control card the sky tsunami and boom, we deal like over 100 damage if he doesn't have the fireball there. Okay. Still gonna go with the executioner here and we're gonna go with the ice golem here. Gonna go zap. Okay, not bad, not bad, not bad at all. We got some good damage going on there. Down there. Okay, now let's fireball this one. Bam, balloon going down. So that's our win, guys, for the back here. Let's crush him with a Royal Giant at the center here. And that's game. Good game. Wow, guys. This deck almost got us to 4,000 trophies. Wow. Not bad. So you guys can see here. Wow, for a level 10 guy with tournament standard cards, we almost reached 4,000 copies. So I hope you guys enjoy the video here. If you do enjoy the video, make sure to subscribe for more videos and kindly like the video and share the video to your friends. And I'll see you guys in the next video and you guys have a good day. And as always guys, keep it together here. Peace out.